Welcome back to Sword of Manor, and I guess it's time to go and meet up with Devious and rescue Burgard. Because he has been kidnapped. Hmm. Oh well, I guess we're going to save those birds later. This room is empty. Master Devious awaits. Alrighty then. Oh, Shadow Zeros! Why can't I hurt them? Um. This is a bad sign. Let's try an axe. Also a bad sign. Um Oh, there we go, the bow. Good. Oh, hi. Cool. I do love the little shadow zeros. They were just called shadows in the first, um, first game, Final Fantasy Adventure, Second and Setsu One. I think they were called shadows in um, Secret Manor as well. And they were like a rare spawn that had sometimes come out of a treasure chest. It was also the maxed out version of the Dark Gate spell, I believe. Um, are we missing something here? There was a whole bunch of treasure chests over there. No, I don't think there's anywhere else we could go. Hmm. In Devious' defense, it is pretty enormously shitty that we killed his mom. I'd be pretty pissed off too. And he was a pretty cool guy up until that moment. It's a fucking ghost. I really don't like that weapon. And socket one. I can't remember what we have and haven't used. I'm just gonna keep this. Apparently in love with me. <laughs> oh, that was good. That satisfied me. Get them! Actually, I want to get a treasure chest of one of them. Oh, no treasure. Let's have a lot of them there. Give it a few seconds and see if they respawn. It's looking like a no. Yay! Well, I'm assuming that um, ringing that bell did something. Wow, two in one blue. That's how to fuck up a Shadow Zero. Hey, where do you think you're going? Yes, got him. <laughs> we are pretty overpowered, admittedly. Hmm. 
where do we go? Don't tell me. Wow. Oh. Still no treasure chest. We're clearing out devious manner of treasure. We're a long way from the desert, little cockatrice. something over here. Ah, oh, there we go. Huh, apparently there's another bell to ring. Get out of here, cockatrice. a different noise. <laughs> or just jump on the thing. That one sounded like it opened the door. Yeah, there we go. One more arrow, god damn it. <laughs> I don't think a single enemy has dropped shit while we've been in here. Oh well. Ow! Okay, um... I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume it's gonna be Silphid. I mean, Jin. Yep. If that's the way to go, or if it's just a way to treasure. It sure does seem like this is the way to go. I'm just gonna check. Oh, treasure. Nice. And Hadouken me. Damn. One more treasure. Ow. Fine. You want some sword? Have some sword. as hell on this place. Mainly because we've come a really long way. Get out of the way!
I'm gonna assume that that did something good. Maybe we have come the right way. It is a weird choice to make that jump button the L button. show any of the end of this place though at least. But I'm definitely gonna keep the bow because yeah we're kicking ass with that thing. I remember when I used the bow in um Secret of Mana, I always used to think it was a really pissy little weapon. Mainly because it shoots like two, three meters in front of you. Once you have the memory of where that goes embedded in you, it is very, very useful. I think we're nearing the top. One more treasure. Of course it would be a fucking ogre box, wouldn't it? You asked for it. Eat a salty bag of dicks. Nice. I'd say we've done the very right thing. Ah, oh, more bells. Oh, a dark point. I still want a tree coin there. Four bells. I thought that was the fourth bell. I guess it just starts on done. Come on, don't be an ogre box. I'd rather take stones than ogre box. Ow! Whoa. What has been ruining our life? Admittedly, I haven't been paying attention. Well, I guess we get no more magic. Eh. They're not worth the Stardust Herbs. Ah, oh, of course. It's alright, our magic is filled back up. I guess it's time to confront Devious. Bogard! Duke, is everybody okay? Everybody but Amanda. Hold on, Bogard, we'll get you out. No good. Devious's powerful magic locks the cage. The spell won't break until he's defeated. Drat. Don't worry about me. This is just more payback for abandoning Medusa. Payback? If I'd used mana power without hesitating, she might have been okay. But sacred mana power... It can't be used to help only one person, otherwise the fabric of society unwinds. Would that really... I made up my mind. Though I tried to do the right thing, I was wrong. From Devious and Dark Lord's perspective, the Mana Clan and I are enemies who hoarded the power of mana. Bogard. From my perspective, you're a guy that repeats the same thing over and over. So 
So nice of you to come, you wretched human. Aw, oh, come on, man. We were buds a while ago. Devious. Now that my mother has passed on, I have no reason to stay in this world. Before I depart, I would like to clear up a certain matter. Devious, you'll pay for what you did to Amanda. Well, he is not pretty. Jeez, this is an annoying boss fight. Heh, <laughs> got him. Oh man. Um. Stop doing that, man. Come on. Glad I got fucking shit tons of those Stardust herbs. I haven't really been using items this whole gameplay. Nice, we got him. Wretched human, finish me off. No, now we're even. I told you to finish me! Are you leaving me wounded so I'll taste fear and pain? That's just as well. Hey, that's not it at all. But I... Devious, shall I end it for you? That voice. Julius, please forgive these foolish humans. It is just their idea of justice to let you live with nothing but pain left. No, stop talking like you know everything. Then why not take your sword and grant his last wish and his suffering? But I... I couldn't. Or you could. Heal his wounds. I happen to have some elixir of life. I'll even let you have a sample. I refuse. I am the proud son of the Medusa family. I'll decide my own fate. Arrgh! My boy, hesitate not when you take up arms. If you have even an ounce of uncertainty, you have no right to raise your sword at all. Hesitate not. With that resolve, you may one day wield the legendary mana sword. Is he dead? What an idiot. Heh. <laughs> His life! I get his life! Some fucking Jester Reaper monster? A bitter aged soul, blending deep despair with profound suffering. Succulent. What is that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Devious, Sis, Medusa, Amanda. In the end, we weren't able to save anybody. The anger and sadness over losing Amanda, it all exploded when I took revenge on Devious. But even then, my heart didn't feel lighter. I'm beginning to understand what Sibber meant. It's laughable to think a guy like me could ever use the Sword of Mana. Duke, do you mind if I sing a song? For my sister, and for Lady Medusa, and for Mr. Devious. Would you use this, Lester? It's Lord Granz's loot. It was the favourite memento of someone who loved him very much. Lester's haunting melody echoes through the town.
Hearts are touched. Even the hearts of the fallen are moved. I guess we can go there now. The melody even reaches as far as Grand's castle. that gourmand thing. That's fucking awful. Eating souls and shit. Mr. Duke, before you go. Genoa. Yay! Lady Medusa had a special place in her heart for this spirit. I entrust it to you. Genoa, I have no right to accept this. It's alright, please take it. Think fondly of Lady Medusa whenever you put it to use. But... Please, go quickly, before my bitterness gets the best of me. Genoa? I'm Luna. That's because I'm a moon spirit, you know. Pleased to meet you. You know what? Lady Medusa had high hopes for you, and the future. The future? You know what else? You can't live in the past. Gotta look ahead. That means you have to THINK ahead. If you're planning to step into the future, I'll go with you. Can't sit here moping forever, can you? Thanks, Luna. Yay, new spirit! New elemental. I'm sorry, but could you all leave me alone for a while so I can clear my thoughts? Go on to Grant's castle without me. Duke. I'll stay behind and wait for Sir Bogard. You and Lester go on. Grant's castle is past my asthma glen. Okay. Try to keep Bogard's spirits up. Let's go, Lester. Sweet. And we got a level up. Alrighty. Time to head back out of town, I think. And... To the hothouse. You're not very strong, are you, Lester? There it is. Yes, we would like to build the hothouse. any forging, but we could definitely get some more plants. Alright, it's time to save it, I think. Well, let's just talk to him on the way out. There we go. Do 
Jeez, this episode's running a bit long. But to be honest, I was kind of done with the desert anyway. There we go. Alrighty guys, if you like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next episode of Sword of Manor. Thanks for watching.